What the heck is going on guys, I'm Xlantech and today I will be teaching you guys how to install and how to run and how to do some benchmarks with a famous FCI Afterburner. Basically, where you can download the program is uh, on Google, of course, the best website ever. Uh, just type MCI Afterburner and guess what then? Just type download and then go on the second link, not the first, the second. Should be obviously go to download 4.3.10 beta 4 version and click here to download it i do not want to download mine because i already have it downloaded like here uh exit the website do not extract it to the desktop i repeat do not extract it to the desktop so you don't want to bother with uh, deleting it so you won't lose your precious time like i did i lost my Five precious seconds of my life from deleting this program. Uh, the language you want to install is obviously English, but if you come from Chinese, Chinesean country, choose Chinese. Um, welcome to Dempsey After Burner Setup Wizard. Click on Next to install it. Oh my God, Skype! Why did you pop up right now? Go accept the terms of the license agreement. Go Next, go Next, go Next, and Next, and Next, and wait. Now wait. Wait for it to extract. It should finish shortly. And now it will ask you to install the Viva, Riva Tuner setup. My primary music is German, but I will use English. Uh, the same version of Riva Tuner statistic. Uh, already stale. Yes, it's a little over it. I will do everything for the sake of my subscribers. Click on install and it should install and then it will ask you for a goddamn reboot. Come on, ask me for a reboot. I do not want to accept it. Come on, ask me. No, I don't want to accept it and I don't want to show the readme file. And I want to run the MC Afterburner. Um, if you notice like uh, here, where was it located like? Mm, here are here is my setup I use uh, the most benchmarks I will be making will be on this uh, what is this like uh, all these packs I have and now I'll be showing you how to edit your layout of your MC After Burner. just go to user interface and click the layout you want to choose I will use the MCI cyber layout it's basically same but only uh, blue and now I'll be showing you how to uh, what was it what was I what was the thing I was going to show you ah yes I was going to show you how to monitor just go to monitoring and go to whatever you want to monitor for example I want to monitor my frame rate if I want to monitor my frame rate I go to showing on display showing on screen display and like that and like that if you notice here I don't have my show in on screen display that's because I don't want it to be shown on my benchmark and hardware pulling period in milliseconds basically choose 100 and then click OK and Riva Tuner statistics server this is an error that you will get every time you use your Riva Tuner let me show you how to use Riva Tuner Riva Tuner server basically what is this program it makes you um, do your uh, it change your change your font on the MCI on your benchmark. Uh, why doesn't it want to open? Oh, yeah, it's located right here. Um, MCI Afterburner is merged with the Riva Tuner. So basically, what you want to do is to choose global. Uh, if you want to choose a vector or raster 3D, vector is the primary the primary font but if you want to add new fonts click on rest free day and then click twice and you can add some fonts i have my font right here it's the best font ever it's typograph pro and also you can edit the size and everything you like everything you please and what's uh, located here uh, basically river tuner is a program that doesn't have any updates more the guys that were making this program gave up on, on it and so basically this program has only this version 6.4.1 <coughs> and that's the latest version 
And now what I'm going to show you, it's a game that I will be showing you and that's a game called... Uh, let me see, a really fast one. Ah, oh, damn, I have only World of Warcraft. Okay, it opened. You can add me at Battle.net if you want. Click on play and it should open up right now. And as you can see on the upper left side of my screen, of my game, uh, is the place where my benchmark is located. Look how beautiful it looks like. And yeah, I don't have a subscription anymore. So let's test the game. How much FPS will I get? Uh, actually, the last video I made is about this um, benchmark. Uh, I will just uh, disable my Gladius so you can see it a little better. Basically, I get smooth 60 FPS, and everything should be fine. This graphics card is really awesome, guys. And basically, guys. That's it, I don't have anything more to teach you for this section. Please feel able to like, share and subscribe. And I will be seeing you guys to the next tutorial. Cheers guys, see you next time.